I'm with Rocky Blyer, and we're discussing first down laser. You know, I've been out of the game so long, 33 years. So, you know, it, it, but as a fan, as a fan, as I'm watching the game, and as I'm watching it from an offensive position, the running backs or the quarterback, whenever they're, whenever they're scrambling, or even as a quick pass over in, in, to the tight end or a, a slant pass to the wide receiver, and they're trying to pick up that first down. And, in, and, and, they're trying, they reach for the ball, they have some sense, some idea, maybe where that first line, and sometimes they fall short. And, and, I, it, it, and I always thought that if they could see it, like we see it on television, if they could see a line, then they know what has to be done. Then they can reach, and then they can try to pick up that first down rather than run out of the bounds beforehand and think, oh, I was, you know, I was close enough, but not, I, I didn't do it. I, I think it would be a great benefit to the players as well as to the fans, just to see what takes place. Another enhancement uh, as this game moves forward. For, for in-fan uh, experience. For an in-fan experience. Right. I think it would be... In-stadium. In, it would, right. For an in-stadium experience of being able to be there, I think you'd. I think that they would concentrate more on what's happening at that line of scrimmage, where it is, where the runner is, where the receiver is, and I, I think it'd just create more interest. And you were running back when you played, yes, right? Yes, I was. And so as the running back, knowing where the line was in front of you, wouldn't that be safer for you to know where it was rather than reaching out and stretching? I, you're right, because the other thing is that when you're trying to, when you're trying to reach for that first down, is it exposes you, and we've seen a time again, fumbles occur, they don't pick up the first down, they lose the ball, they change the momentum of the game, um, and or at times they get hurt going out over bounds because they're outstretched uh, to be able to uh, pick up that first down. So yeah, it'll give you a better sense. You can make a better decision whether you're going to try to go for the first down or control the ball and you know, maybe fall short, but at least you know where the line is. So you think it'd be a benefit to the game? Well, I think it'd be an awesome benefit to the game. Well, Rocky, I appreciate it. Thank you very much. You're welcome. <laughs> You know, the changes in the game uh, from, a, from a fan experience is that the Texas Stadium and Jerry Jones, when he built that new stadium and put the big screen almost from 20-yard line to 20-yard line, because his, his question was, who am I competing against? And the answer is he's competing against home. He's competing against the home fan. So if I can bring that experience to the stadium and give him the, 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 the same experience of either watching it or viewing it on on the field, uh, I, I'm better off as an as an owner. And so, if if you can create the fan experience as if it's sitting at home, a fan would rather be at the stadium uh, and be a part of that whole atmosphere rather than uh, sitting at home. But you got to give them the experience. Right. So the yellow line. So would... the yellow line would come in perfectly uh, in this case. Yellow line on television. We know where it is. We need to have the we need to have that yellow line on the field so that we get that same experience. Terrific, Rocky. Thank yeah. you very much.